Welcome to War Chief of Light is back with another epic video. Hi, my name is PBG, but you lovely people are more than welcome to call me peeps. We're in for it. Listen, we've already done two of these, so I'm just going to keep going and see how she goes. Today, we are reacting to the new Warcraft Legacies Chapter 3. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I, this is going to be a newer story for me because I don't know the lore to it. So, I'm here for it. Like the last couple, they have been fantastic the art style great so we're not going to be commenting on that let's look at the content of it and react no stormu wait you have led me through all these moments in time yet now you ask me to guide you there is a blind spot in my vision of a time before naltharion's corruption and I believe it centers upon you. I must know why. Seek him out in your memory. It was my honor to command a battalion. We executed Neltharion's will precisely. Our devotion and discipline were unmatched. That armor looks bad. A Titan artifact? That must be the source of your unity. This was an ancient magic that bound you to his will. Would you not sacrifice yourselves at his whim? We were soldiers. There were many threats to the world. And here was the greatest. The Primalists. That is Razageth, the Storm Eater. One of the leaders of the Primalist Rebellion. He struck without warning, without honor. And I lost many friends this day. We fell back. Regrouped. Then, everything became jumbled, confused. The artifact destroyed, and the order magic which had united the Drakthir was dispelled. How then was Razageth defeated? Why were we imprisoned? Time. Why did we sleep for so long? If he could no longer control the Drakthir, he would have deemed you a risk. No. We laid down our lives for him. He was proud of us. Why would he... Stop this sand! I cannot see! Because you do not want to. Yet you can only become more than you are. If you confront your past. Okay, how does she go? Away. 
forgot we even existed. There's... It would have been kinder to simply destroy us. I am sorry, my young friend. We had to know the truth. But do not despair. I now believe that Neltharion locked you away because of what you might become. What we might achieve, free of his control. And now, you are free. This world has much to offer, and you will have a part to play in the events to come. You spoke of an ancient enemy's return. It is Razageth and the Primalists. That is why we were awakened. It seems that Neltharion yet had a purpose for you, but he is gone. You must decide which path you will take, which okay, story you will agency. tell. My story will be my own. Not as strong. Not as strong. I have to admit that. I don't know much about Titan lore previous. I don't know how accurate that part is. So I'm going to be very honest. This is a feeling, okay? So you can take that with a grain of salt. This is a giant retcon? Question mark? It feels that way to slip the Drakthir in. Which, fine. Listen, there's some parts that you can sit there and admit. Listen, Nazoth had him mad. Way mad. In uh, the Will of Eternity situation. He was long gone at that point. So, is it possible that he was going, going, gone prior to that? Absolutely. Was he going... When he unleashed that power, could that have done it? No, I think Nazoth doesn't typically work that way. He tends to slowly creep in. And that's kind of the story that we've been told about Deathwing. So, uh, I could be wrong. And listen, if I'm wrong, let me know. I can handle being wrong. This feels like a big retcon. To add the Draxir in. I also don't like the th part where he mentioned, hey, listen, it's because he, th he didn't want you guys to become bad. No, when he was corrupted by Nazoth, at least as far as I understood it, he had trouble trusting. So that is very understandable. Even his own dragon flight, he had a hard time trusting, which again, understandable, but he wasn't protecting others. He was becoming mad within himself. He didn't think people would stick with him or believe him. Or he wasn't trying to protect others from themselves or what they would become. It's because he thought he was being betrayed. So, I don't know. This one kind of sits off with me. It doesn't really fit. But then again, this is the part that's not written. Or... I haven't read it. Listen, it's very possible that I haven't read this one. And that's fine. Again, I'm totally okay to be wrong. She feels like a wreck god. Is it a good one? If it is, okay, let's pretend that I'm actually like on board. We're doing good here. Is it a good one? It's all right. I mean, it doesn't change what happened it doesn't destroy the past to include a new race um a little bit heavy-handed on the you're free to make your own path we get it you're the player cool uh but other than that yeah it's not a bad idea to slide them into the story there but I don't like the connotations that changed with Deathwing and how maybe he was protective rather than m succumbed. Because the reality is, is that Nazoth 
succumbed, he succumbed to Nazoth. He did. That's the reality. And the story continues on his descent into complete madness. I could be wrong. And if I am, that's okay. The only part that about that that is weird, which it comes back to the storytelling of the game in game, is that if more of the storytelling was in the game, there wouldn't be debate on whether that actually happened or whether that was a good retcon or a bad retcon, etc., etc., because we would know the story. Uh, to me, this one, again, Visually beautiful. Sounds great. This one, actually, I don't like. Be honest, I don't like it. I don't like the, again, the heavy-handed player agency that they're given. I get it, you're trying to write it in, but again, it really feels obvious and heavy-handed. It does feel retconned, or that part of the lore has was poorly described in the past. One of the two. So, yeah. I feel like this one is probably the first real miss of the series. But again, that's just my opinion. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section down below. In the meantime, have a legendary night. Thanks so much for being here, and I can't wait to see you guys again on the next one. Bye. Maybe I'm a little young, but you don't know what I've become. Can't you see it in my face?